say Pikachu? Pika. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the biggest anime among Japanese fans. <laughs> Number 10 Sailor Moon Franchise. In the time it takes to do a transformation sequence, Sailor Moon became one of the most iconic anime brands ever made. And to think it was only supposed to air for six months. However, the show's balance of cool fights, heartwarming characters, and optimistic themes extended it into a legendary five-year run, plus some spin-offs and sequels just for good measure. With overwhelming praise and record-breaking merchandise sales, it's no wonder that Sailor Moon is still ubiquitous to this day. At this point, it's basically the face of the whole magical girl genre, both in and out of Japan. Number 9. Jujutsu Kaisen Yuji Itadori's cursed clashes are entertaining in every language, but something about the high-octane fights and devilish storylines have kept Japanese audiences in particular coming back for more. Maybe it's because the show takes place in Japan. Or maybe seeing Yuji clock someone with a black flash is just that cool. Either way, it's obvious Jujutsu Kaisen is a household name even among casual anime watchers. The manga is a bestseller, the movie made bank, and the show is ranked as one of the most in demand in the entire world. Given that, it'd be strange if Japan didn't love Jujutsu Kaisen. Number 8. Crayon Shin-chan In stark contrast to high-stakes battle anime, this is a simple story about a simple Japanese kid going about his simple, everyday life. Oh, and it's aired for over a thousand episodes and counting. <laughs> Say my name, Devil! What about this? While the setup sounds mundane, Shin Chan's mischievous life is just zany enough to keep Japanese viewers glued to their screen. It might be time to visit that therapist again. Okay. Oh no. <gasps> You're not going anywhere. <laughs> it's just a shame more people can't get on board. Since most of the series' humor relies on linguistic puns and cultural references, Crayon Shinchan has never really caught on outside of its native country. Then again, considering it's aired almost non stop for over 30 years, we'd say Shinchan is doing just fine. Hima started getting junky in her trunky, and mom was too busy killing dad to change her. The crap I put up with in the line of duty. Hooray for Stenchman! <laughs> Number 7 Demon Slayer Kimetsu no Yaiba. If you thought Tanjiro and the others were prominent overseas, you may want to sit down. In Japan, Demon Slayer isn't just a hit show, it's a full-on cultural phenomenon. Each new episode is like a countrywide holiday, and it has the ratings to prove it. Demon Slayer is so impactful, it's even making it into Japanese textbooks. <laughs> Although, that makes sense when you remember how many records it's broken, including the title of highest grossing Japanese film. Like, ever. Live action included. Given that Demon Slayer is still in its prime, odds are good it'll stay on top for years to come. Oh, 
Number 6. Doraemon Franchise When you look into the eyes of this time-traveling robotic cat, you're looking at a complete cultural celebrity. We aren't joking. While starring in three self-titled anime series definitely helped his brand recognition, Doraemon's success goes way beyond television screens. Its influence on Japanese media is unshakable, to the point we may not have had series like One Piece or Naruto without Doraemon. Maybe bigger doesn't always mean better? Ah, oh, jeez, everyone's a critic! <laughs> <laughs> Then, in 2008, Japan's foreign ministry appointed the Earless Cats as the country's first ever anime ambassador. That's right, Doraemon is so absurdly well known, it's capable of representing Japan as a whole. You can't get any bigger than that. <laughs> Number 5. Dragon Ball Franchise Even a wish on Shenron himself wouldn't be enough to do Dragon Ball's legacy justice. Japan's tried, though. <laughs> On top of several anime series, movies, video games, and a truly staggering amount of merchandise, they officially anointed May 9th as Goku Day. So yeah, you could say Dragon Ball's pretty big over there. Its creative footprint is simply unmatched, especially in the anime industry. You'd be hard-pressed to find any modern shonen that doesn't owe something to Akira Toriyama's groundbreaking work. Even if Goku eventually retires from world-shaking fights, and that's a big if, Dragon Ball's impact on Japan isn't going anywhere anytime soon. Toriyama's legacy lives on. Number 4. One Piece He may not be King of the Pirates just yet, but Monkey D. Luffy still stumbled on a massive treasure trove of success in Japan. Yes, the anime is an explosive trailblazer, and yes, the series has off-the-charts name recognition. But the real kicker is that One Piece is the best-selling manga series of all time, and it's not even close. Luffy's swashbuckling adventures fly off the shelves faster than they could be printed. That demand has created a typhoon of a franchise, one where keeping up isn't just a recommendation anymore, it's a societal necessity. There may be other hit shows, but there will never be another One Piece. Number 3. Detective Conan There's nothing to investigate here. The only mystery is why this show isn't bigger. Japan has the right idea. Detective Conan, also known as Case Closed in other territories, is the quintessential detective program. <laughs> it's frequently dark, exceptionally smart, and always a good time from start to finish. Despite being transformed into an elementary kid's body, Conan has been solving cases on a weekly basis since 1996. <laughs> the shtick hasn't even gotten old yet. If anything, Detective Conan's long-standing history just proves why it's one of Japan's best and brightest. There's always a new twist, a new culprit, and a new case to keep you hooked. <laughs> Number 2. Chibi Maruko-chan This show lives and breathes on the idea that less is more, which is incredibly ironic when you look at how long it's been on the air. 
But there's a good reason Maruko's antics have stood the test of time. Chibi Maruko-chan isn't frivolous or shocking or anything like that. It's just honest. Sure, there's a few laughs and usually a good moral at the end of the episode, but it's all tied into an earnest story about Japanese life. As a result, Chibi Maruko-chan has a uniquely broad appeal for all ages. And it's used that to stay at the top of the charts for decades now. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Suzai-san Here it is, the undisputed champion of Japanese anime. Suzai-san is more than a show to its country, it's practically an everyday part of life. For one, it stayed on the air for over 60 years, becoming the longest-running animated program of all time. <laughs> Secondly, it's aired in the Sunday time slot for so long, it's created a phenomenon called Sazai san Syndrome, where people associate new episodes with the end of the weekend. Something about the way it characterizes traditional Japanese values through humor has clearly resonated with people. So it makes a lot of sense why Suzai san is often cited as the national anime. Which of these series deserve more global recognition? Let us know in those comments below. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from Watch Mojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.